Hi folks, today I want to show you how to set up a best monitoring tool ever. Of course, I am talking about Grafana and Prometheus. So, I prepared a little project to show you how you can set up Linux host monitoring with Node Exporter, Prometheus, C Advisor, because we will get running container metrics, and of course Grafana. Pay attention to these params in Node Exporter, because we will monitor the host itself. And also take a closer look on the commands in Prometheus node. It shows the config file location. C advisor will be useful for containers monitoring, that's why check these mounted volumes. And main unit in our compose file, Grafana. Check all mounted files and special volume for Grafana settings. It will be helpful to store all Grafana settings between restarting the service. The dashboard provider config will tell the Grafana server where it can take our prepared default dashboards. And data source config will describe Prometheus location. The Prometheus config itself will describe a jobs inside. In first section, Prometheus and C Advisor hosts and port are presented. And in the second one, uh, which called Linux metrics, there is a list of hosts with Node Exporter on board. It can be a solid array of machines, but in our case, there is only one host, local host. Okay, fine. Now you get a full picture of what's happened in backend. Let's start our project and check how it works. Use Docker Compose app to start project. It will pull the images from Docker registry if you starting it first time and it can get some time. When all nodes display healthy status, you can check Grafana web UI. By the way, Grafana credentials are stored in .env file. Do not forget to set them. Okay, nice. We have a local Grafana server and now let's check our default dashboards. They are presented in monitoring directory and was mounted to the Grafana node. Firstly, basic Linux metrics. Looks awesome, isn't it? I think it can be very useful for service monitoring. Second one, simple dashboard for Linux laptop monitoring. I use it for my own laptop, for example. Now let's check next one with Postgres performance metrics. And as expected, it's empty, cause we should set up Postgres data source first. So let's do this in configuration data sources. Let's find Postgres data source and add it to our server. And now we can set up connection to Postgres database. And pay attention that it's highly recommended to set database user for Grafana to allow only select operations. Now let's switch back to our Postgres dashboard and check it again. And it works. You can check active queries and other performance metrics of your Postgres database. Let's have a look on one of the widgets. As you can see, it's a simple SQL query on backend.
And the last default dashboard that I would like to show you is a docker container matrix. It can transform container monitoring from this Oh, wait a minute, <laughs> I should open it and just switch, but wait a minute. To this looks more friendly, isn't it? And a most advanced feature of Grafana that I will show you right now is a great community with uh, hundreds of very nice designed dashboards and matrix collectors. You can easily import them to your local server. Well, dashboard fetched from the web and now we need to set default data source for it. And it works fast and easy. Well, now you know how to get Linux host metrics like a pro. Hope this video was helpful for you. Of course, link to GitHub will be in description below. Goodbye.